the peak is our, we are the one contrary to our, our nature at, at the max. So therefore, there's no more need for it because that's what was as quickly to yes. make us contrary. Right. Now there's only right. one other way to go. It's back the other way, back to our righteous self. Right. Which is it. Back right. to our nature. We right. activate that nature. All right, now let me get this uh, special for you. Psalm chapter 8 of 58 verse 3. The wicked are estranged from the womb. <laughs> they go astray as soon as they be born and speak lie. Now they, they go estranged. They're estranged as they, they come out the womb. They're estranged, demonic people. Right? And, they, and they, when, they out, when they come out the womb, they speak lies. And they spoke every all kinds of lies to our people. The Native American Indians. It says, he's a liar and the father of lies. We ain't there. Talk to somebody. Bro. Right. Yeah, now 666 is how it took you 600 years to bring him into, six, into existence. It took 60,000 aboriginal people to bring him, to grab him into existence. In 6,000 years that he will rule, that time is up, it's over. He's already scared like hell. 666 is the number of the image. Now that he have uh, understanding, know the number of the beast. He's the number of a man. It's the name of a man. They say that the spook, the spirit. It's the name of a man. Right. That's that's it right there. Right, that's him. Right. Yeah. You know what I mean? So vicious, ruthless, conniver. Creates divide and conquer because unity is power. He goes in and divides us. It's like you get to our brother and sister going uh, it's over there in Iraq, and Afghanistan, and well, Libya. Well, here's the thing. Well, here's here's the thing. Our brothers and sisters are the people on this. Because here's the thing. Right. Everyone, Everyone. 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 around the world. No, 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 no. We're not brothers to Africans. We're not Africans on our brother. They put us into slavery. No. All the Aboriginal people with color on this earth are the same people. No, the Arab Whatever you guys say, no. just because they're on that continent or on this, nah, they're still our people. They I don't care what they did. They will if there's anything contrary happen, it's because that man. They will kill you. That's because they made that. They caused our people to divide. Man, come on, man. Yeah, but yeah, but our yeah, but our people is not. You guys get confused. No, no, you got it confused, man. Just not there, like, you know something. <laughs> hey, man, not not everybody's the same people because they got color, man. and that's something that too that not. I mean, I guess obviously with Native Americans too, but a lot of you niggas, a lot of a lot of you niggas in that in that in that uh black um. Black consciousness type shit, man. This, not everybody's the same. I mean, because look, you're not going to accept the Arab that's darker than you. So it's not about color; it's about nationality. Everybody's a different shade of brown on this planet, except for the so-called white. That's something you don't understand. Well, according to the Bible, it says that he was a very dark-skinned man with woolly hair. Now, nobody on the planet Earth is black. All right. <laughs> Just like nobody on the planet Earth is white. Right. So. According to the Bible, we all descended to either Adam and Eve or Noah and his wife. We did, we did. But that doesn't mean we're the same people. Right. That means we can be of the same species, but we are still different nationality and bloodline. Right, right, right. Okay. okay. I'm, I'm royal Alaskan Native princess. Oh, really? Well, you know what? Hey. You bless and your heart. A child of God, bless your heart. Well, you, well, you yeah, you're one, you one of our people. Then you'll be. I know. I know. Will you be of the tribe of Gad? You'll be of the tribe of Gad, a North American Indian. Yeah. Our people are, in fact, the real Israelites. Native Americans, Negroes, and Hispanics. We are the real people of the Bible. You know, okay? I watched a um, a show one time that plays everybody's DNA. Yeah. Everybody came from Africa in the first place. Well, really, see, Africa is a concept. Right. Because it's a it's a continent. Because yeah, it's a continent. So you can say that it's not you can say everybody came from Africa. Because technically Israel is the mother of us all, the right. Bible says. Right. So you can say that Israel is on the African continent. But to get technical and pinpointed, we all came from Adam, the Garden of Eden, in the Middle East, right. the Israel area. Oh. Okay? Right. Now the oldest uh, the oldest uh, artifact ever found was found in Israel. It predates every uh, known artifact that they have. Coinciding and substantiating what the Bible is saying. Okay? Uh, do you believe that the Noah's Ark was found in Israel? You know what? I, I don't know. They, there's some good evidence on that, right. but I can't say for sure. Because well, 
I believe my people are descended from Mongolia. Mongolia, that's what they say. But that's what they say. I saw a Chinese man on the bus the other day, he looked Alaska native. Yeah. And I asked him if he was, he goes, no. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, because yeah, my father, my father's actually the last name. Is he? Yeah, and you know, um, his father looked had that half. He had that half Asian, half um, Native American appearance. Now, I'm gonna say this, right? Just dealing with the, oh, um, just dealing with like um, the Native Americans up in Alaska. Now, there's some like just uh, people of Japanese family, like North Islanders that right. come up here. That, right. And there's some white people up here. There's some black people that make up with the Indians. Right. But here's the thing. Now, from my, what I've researched, a lot of a lot of them they come from um, a particular set of people over here in Japan called the Nuit Samurai. Yeah, this is what I was researching. But now, now I can I can go into it, but it's, it'll be a long story. But a lot of those customs that those Native Americans that, that hold up here actually goes along with the Islamic people. You know the fringes, right? Right, those, right, right. Those those, those little uh, Indian type of stuff. How did he have it for those cold winters? Right. Yeah, they have a little those, those fringes, and that's what we have right here. You see the, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know Very strong. Yeah. See, that, that's one custom they kept. So, you know, you know, people, the indigenous people of North. At first, I saw this. I thought you guys were sick. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Everybody thinks that. You know why? Because basically, they can't read. Basically, they they're also brainwashed. Yeah, they don't know how to read. All you gotta do is read the sign. If you're not white, you're not good enough. Right. Right, exactly, right. exactly. And that's how they think. Okay, I know. But they don't know that the Lord cursed him with lack of melanin and pigmentation. That's an actual curse. That's why they're running to the tanning salon and they're running to get lip injections and butt implants and trying to get curvy like the indigenous colored people of the planet. They want to be like us, but they hate us. I came up with a horribly hateful song that God forgive me, but it's true. You're all trash, founded America, out the beer. That's right. Thank you. Yes, that's God right. Bless you too. Glad you're not sick with your person. That's two Native Americans that came up today confirming that the white man is the devil. Yeah. <laughs> Confirming that the white people are the wicked robbers and spoilers of the planet. Right. 